Hello, it's me, Jeremy Renner. Today I'm going to be talking about an important part of American history. Specifically, the history in which Texas fought for its independence from Mexico in a great battle. This battle was fought at the Franciscan mission known as the Alamo, which will be the topic of today's film. Before discussing the battle, let's first dig into the origins of the legendary building. Construction on the Alamo initially began in 1744. An interesting fact to know is that though this project was for Franciscan missionaries, the planning of the building was actually led by Frenchman René Descartes, who spent years on this architecturally revolutionary design, though he eventually went on to study philosophy during the later years of his life. Construction continued on at an incredibly slow pace until the invention of the telephone in 1786, when builders were finally able to call their own boss to say that they had actually finished building years ago. This was highly upsetting to the elder Descartes, so much so that, according to local rumor that is, it caused him to have a sudden heart attack and die, no doubt out of anger. His family was so angered by his death that they sought vengeance against the Texan builders. And after two years of planning, Descartes' distant grandson, Francisco Pizarro, came all the way from France to the San Antonio build site, announcing that he was there to seize control over the Texan territory. In the name of France, he is recalled to have yelled. Over 15,000 Texans and Mexicans died protecting the Alamo. After Mexican and Texan residents fought from October 1935 all the way to April of 1936, the Texas Revolution had come to an end. A ceremony celebrating the end of the war was held within the Alamo, and the celebration was great. The influence of the Alamo, and especially in remembrance of the party following the Great Battle, was great on popular culture. So much so that a miniature recreation of the mission can be found in Las Vegas, bringing in 15% of the city's revenue. This is called Little Alamo. The recreation is very small. To this day, the Alamo stands as the only remaining building in the entirety of Texas. All the more reason and importance that we must remember the Alamo. Thank you for listening. I hope you enjoyed this presentation.